大丈夫ですかはいはいじゃあ撮ります Learning to drive in a foreign country can be pretty scary. It's a big commitment, but it can grant you the freedom to explore your surroundings beyond the limits of public transportation. I think I'm finally ready to challenge myself and get my driver's license here in Japan. Hey guys, how's it going? It's Michaela, and today is a really big day for me. I've been looking forward to this for a really long time. I've never driven a car in my life, even in Canada. I came over here when I was 17, so I never had a chance to get my license in Canada. And after years of making excuses and being kind of afraid of the commitment of driving, I think I'm finally ready to take responsibility. So I'm here at Fukuoka Prefecture Driving School. In Canada, to get your driver's license, it can take like, I think up to a year or so, or maybe more,、um, to go from a beginner, a learner's permit to a full driver's license. But in Japan, if you go to driving school and you take the proper classes and you graduate the school, And then you go on to take the test. You can get your driver's license、um, as quickly as within like a month or a month and a half. So I'm gonna take this opportunity to learn how to drive and then I can get my license when I go to Canada too. Seems pretty convenient, right? Everybody here looks way younger than me. Me too. Me too. So it's registration day, and、um, I'm just waiting to be called so I can do my registration. To register, you need to bring your j u m i n k y o which is a、uh, piece of paper you can get from City Hall that has your address and your status of residence and all that important information on it.、Um, and then also bring your passport or photo ID. I think your j u m i n k card can be okay as well. But yeah, that's where I'm at right now. I'm really excited to get started though. First thing you do after you register is get your photo taken and take a、uh, eye test. はい、では撮りまーす。Driving school is split into two parts: the path to a learner's permit and the path to a full license. In the first level, I'll need to attend 10 hours of classes and pass a written test before I can take my learner's permit exam. After I pass that, I'll need to take another 16 hours of classes before I can take the final exam. Hi. <laughs> ですね。There is a lot of studying involved. Luckily, if you're still studying Japanese, they do have English and Chinese textbooks, and you can choose to take the written tests in English or Chinese as well. But not all classes are textbook based. One of the mandatory lessons is a three hour intensive CPR training course. So,、uh, I just had my emergency CPR class.、Uh, you can probably tell because my lipstick is super smudged, but、um, we use these dolls. These dolls are called Jammy. Jammy is dying and he needs our help. So, my lipstick is super smudged because we just did the CPR lesson and it's really intense. They have us doing the 30. Chest compressions and the breathing over and over and over again.、Um, in Fukuoka Prefecture, apparently it takes an average of six minutes for an ambulance, six and a half minutes for an ambulance to arrive. So、uh, it's important to practice CPR and make sure that like, you're tough enough that you can keep it up for six and a half minutes、um, until help comes because that can make a huge difference. So I just got the results for my aptitude test and I'm pretty sure that they don't do this. In Canada, at least. I don't know if they do this anywhere else, but I wanted to talk about it and I wanted to show you for a second because I think it's really cool. It gives you a ranking based on your 
concentration skills, your decision making skills, your flexibility, how safe you are with your answers and your thoughts. If you read it here, it says that um, my moods change very quickly and uh, I can have lots of confidence, but when I have confidence, I usually make mistakes. Um, I have to be careful not to um, lose my mental balance and take care when I'm driving or else I can cause trouble because I'll be too stuck in my own head, which is very accurate. So the test is really weird and it asks a bunch of really obscure questions that have nothing to do with driving, but um, you know, when you read the description, I think it is actually pretty accurate. Finally, to obtain a learner's permit, I'll need to log 12 hours of driving inside the school driving course. Once I've got my learner's permit, it's another 19 hours of driving on public roads and expressways until I can take my test to get my full license. Uh, hi. あ、はい。あ、はい。はい。こんにちは。こんにちは。改めましてよろしくお願いします。そしたらですね、今日は初めての運転をしていくということで、はい。この準備を大丈夫ですか。No. <笑> まだね。まだね、緊張してますよね。緊張してますよね。ま、車の運転緊張するんですけども、今日の目標はまず楽しく乗っていきましょう。はい。オッケーですかね。はい。よし。じゃあまず早速乗り込んでもらったら目標からや